Welcome to the Historical Report with Michael Pumpkinbottom. Hi, I'm reporter Michael Cannonbottom. No! I mean, I'm Michael Pumpkinbottom. I'm here in Philadelphia at the National Historic Landmark, Fort Mifflin. Behind me is the North Gate, a portal to another time. Look at that studded gate. I think it's also in the shot. As you can see, we are also surrounded by a moat that I almost fell in. Too many planes here, man. It's too loud. Hey, hey, look. What? It's the moat. Well, the I want to get ready for the shot. Hey, oh, 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 Yeah. Yeah. The moat. Yeah, there's a moat. There is. <laughs> Haunted Fort Mifflin. This place is haunted. <laughs> artillery shed and check out these guns Ooh. big guns huh Ooh. definitely not my arms that reminds me i need to get back into the gym i bet the <laughs> anyways i bet those cannons could handle a ghost hi i'm here in the casemates it's a really spooky place to be these casemates are bomb proof enclosures for troops and living quarters these casemates were designed to keep you safe from bombs, but not ghosts. Wait, what? Why was that on the cue card, man? There's no such thing as ghosts. It's freaking me out. Let's get out of here. Hi, we're here at the Commandant's house. This is the last defensive bastion here in the fort. The Commandant's house. That's right, I said it twice. Because sometimes, I'm an idiot. Anyway, look, this reporter is going to be real honest with you all. Why the heck would the Commandant hang out here in such a scary place like this? It doesn't make any sense. I'm getting freaked out already just standing here. My mustache is getting freaked out. I don't like this place. I'm getting real uneasy. I don't know if you guys saw or... Ah! Wait, that's all you were chasing me for? Oh, you're sorry. Fort Mifflin. Costumes and curves on Halloween weekend. Goodbye and happy Halloween. <laughs>